Hello, Laverne here. May God bless this video, yada, yada, yada. Today I'm going to give you several examples showing that the Apostle Paul is a false apostle, a liar, and a dirty, rotten, pathetic scoundrel. Jesus warned us against hypocrites, and Paul was a hypocrite with a capital H. <laughs> the first thing I notice is that in Romans 16, 24, 25, Paul refers to, and I quote, my gospel. In other places, Paul loves to point out that he got his gospel from Christ. But here he says it is his gospel. This shows that he puts the preaching of Jesus Christ second and is exalting himself, which is something he loves to do. Next we'll take note of 1 Corinthians 4.14. Here again that egomaniac Paul is exalting himself. Jesus warned us in Matthew 23.9 to let no man call us father. This is a clear red flag that Paul is a false apostle and an idiot. <laughs> Satan! Satan! Paul is a false apostle! <laughs> Next we see that Paul told us not to take brothers to law in a secular court. But Paul is an evil stinking hypocrite because when he was on trial before Festus, he appealed to Caesar as one who had Roman citizenship. Ha ha ha. The next problem with that idiot Paul is that in 1 Corinthians he clearly tells people that if they are not circumcised they should remain that way. But in the book of Acts he changes his tune and takes Timothy to be circumcised. That's not only glaring hypocrisy, it also probably hurt a whole lot. <laughs> Finally, brothers and sisters, let's notice a particularly sad example of Paul having a heart of unforgiveness. Paul refuses to let Mark travel with him because of an earlier offense by Mark. If Paul were truly a loving and forgiving Christian rather than having a very hard heart of unforgiveness, he would have let Mark travel with him, so there too.